Good evening, teacher. Hi, good evening, Jonathan. How are you? Uh, pues, por aquí. Bien, fine. Good, good. How was, how, how was your day at your, uh, at your work? Uh, I, I, work, I work hard. Really? Um, yeah. Um, to, to work uh, since starting. Ay, really? Sí, y, lo, do, y somos cuatro. Entonces nos turnamos. Yo entro a las siete y salgo a las tres. Pero estoy de siete a cinco. Wey. That's a lot of work. Ah. Sí, entonces mañana me toca igual. Uh -huh. Hasta que se presente uno de los dos. Porque el otro no se sabe. Ajá, ajá. Pero um, hace, hace varios días que salieron así. Eh, no, creo que fue ayer. ¿Y was yesterday? ¿Really? Ayer se fue uno. Uh -huh. El otro ya se había ido antes, pero ahora se dio cuenta que sí es. Oh, my God. It is positive. Uh -huh. But uh, in the case, in, in, in your case, um, do you, do you uh, have you taken the, the, you know, like the exam to know if you might be positive or not? The el otro no se sabe. Uno Ajá. Sí. Ajá. Y, Yo... y usted se ha hecho examen, pues como, no sé, de cierto modo han tenido contacto. Ah, este, un examen no me he hecho, pero tampoco he tenido síntomas, ¿verdad? Uh -huh, este, uh -huh. Sí, también soy, ya tengo las dos dosis, pero eso veo que ya no sirve de mucho, porque ellos también tienen las dos dosis. Ah, uh -huh. Así que, no se sabe, yo por lo menos ahorita me he separado, me he aislado un poco. Ajá, so, so let's see how they are going to react with that, right? Entonces, habrá que ver qué tal, cómo, cómo evolucionan. Supongo que no han de estar muy, muy, muy enfermos, right? I guess, supongo. Por el momento, no, pero no pueden salir tampoco. No, oh, yeah, I mean, that's, that's, that's definitely, sí. right? Like, uh -huh. they have to, they have to be in their houses because they, they cannot go out that way. No pueden salir así. They might infect other people. Yeah, I mean, there are a lot of people that are getting infected. Igual ya hay bastantes personas que igual están saliendo así. But, I mean, hay muchos que sí se cuidan. Hay otros que, que ya no andan, like, with a face mask, ya no andan mascarilla. Sí, bastante. Ahí, los, bueno, yo les le, le digo, si hay gente ahí que lleva su mascarilla, que yo no lo voy a atender si no se pone la mascarilla y se molesta. Pues sí, pero es que, que deben entender de que a pesar, o sea, de que estén vacunados, ya no significa que estén exentos de que puedan a, agravarse en algún, en, en algún caso. Ya. Yeah. Sí, claro. Yeah, exactly. Can I be like possible? Pero hay muchos que no comprenden eso. ¿Cuál es? Entonces, qué bien que todos hiciéramos el esfuerzo y, y, y al menos tuviéramos un poco de conciencia en ese aspecto y supongo que de esa manera el virus no se propagara tanto. Sí, no hubieran pero... tantos. Ajá. Like, you know, like too many people infected. Pero ni en pandemia pasó eso. Ahorita han, se han ido 12 personas del taller. Hey. <laughs> That's a lot of people. Ya, yes, así son bastantes días, sí. personas son entonces. <risa> vale, sí. Vamos a ver entonces, ojalá que logren recuperarse y vuelva pronto, porque sí, I can't tell. Supongo que la carga de trabajo es like, like very hard for you. Sí. And very difficult, right? Mm. Yeah, to be the whole day. But let's see what happens in the future. So, um, hey, where are you? What happened to the other people? Ah, oh, yeah, they're getting connected. Okay. Uh, good evening for the rest of the class. This is Jonathan. So, good evening, Carla, Maritza, Ruth, Eric, Vanessa, and Andrea Cristales. Good evening, everybody. 
Good evening. <laughs> Good evening, teacher. Good oh, teacher. evening, everybody. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you. I, I, I'm, I'm like observing that you're like, like with the camera stuff now, but I was like, like, like that. So, how was your day, people? I was talking to Jonathan, so now tell me a little bit about your day. I'm gonna start off with uh, uh <laughs> ah, no, you, you are the one from Andrea Cristales, and I was like, who is Andrea Cristales? <laughs> my, my daughter. Ah, okay, all right. Let's change your name because I got, I got, you know, like, I get confused. So I'm gonna start with, uh, with Eric. How was your day, Eric? So, so teacher. Yeah. Uh, with a lot of work. Thank you, Nubia. <laughs> With a lot of work, Eric. Uh, yes. Um. Um. He estado moviéndome de una de centro de distribución hacia la oficina. Mm. He estado con un servidor. Yeah, es bien entretenido. Yeah, I mean, bien entretenido. Kind of, yeah, kind of playing with that, right? <laughs> Okay, that's that's pretty cool. In the morning, in the morning, le di el recado. Nah. Di su recado. What did he say? Ah, este, que estaba viendo cómo hacía para uh, send you the package. <laughs> Yo sabía que se iba a poner ahí. Yeah, like, 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 there were like three times that he told me, hey, look, I'm going to send you a package. I mean, I was like, okay, all right. I will be ready to receive it. But that was like more than a month ago. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> kind of like that. <laughs> ah, poor Salvador. <laughs> okay, all right. Uh, so... Let's try to continue with this. Uh, so like, let's see how many people do I got right now? Nine people. All right, let's start up. So good evening, everybody. Welcome evening. to this video conference number four. So like, like four, yeah. So we got a lot of information today, uh, you know, like to share today. And let's start up with uh, the attendance list. All right, choose to, to start. Let me check. So let's just start up. All right, let's just start up with Ana Claribel. Not here. Ana Maria. <laughs> okay, she's not here. Carlos Adenir. Hey, Carlos is not connecting. She's like once. Eric Guillermo. Present teacher. Okay. Ever de Jesus. Present teacher. Okay. Nice. Uh, Fatima Alejandra. No, she's not here, right? So, Hilmar Cruz. Present. Justo. Come on, man. Just on time again. Yes. <laughs> It was like yesterday. Just on time. <laughs> okay. Quien, tenía tener, quien solía tener esa habilidad era, era Natalie. Justo cuando a mencionarla iba, aparecía. Pero en ese dos módulos atrás, ahí me iba perdiendo. Me leía la mente. Exactly, right. Ya, yeah, and I was like, iba comenzando con los primeros, ya justo dos antes de pasarla a ella, se conectaba. Pero ahora en la, en la segunda, listo. Ya, yeah, miren, the second one. Ahí viene a aparecer en la segunda. <laughs> Let's see. Jonathan Alexander. Present. Ok, good. Uh, Jorge Elvir. He's not here yet. Uh, let's see. Carla Benacer. Present, teacher. Ok, good. Margot Hernández. No, she's not connected yet. Maritza Alcira. Present teacher. Do you feel better, Maritza? Um, I 
Just... A little bit. Uh, I can't tell. Uh, my better... day is terrible. Terrible. Ter terrible? Really? Terrible. Yeah. Have you had a fever? Yes. Ooh. Tengo amigdalitis. Eso es horrible. Ya, yeah, I mean, that's horrible. Ay, sí. Bueno, medio escuché lo que estaban conversando cuando, cuando iniciaron y, y un señor me comentaba en el seguro hoy. Yes. Mire, yo vengo, me dice, porque tengo una hija que es médico. Y me dijo que viniera a pasar consulta porque tantos eran los casos que se anunciaba un cierre y que me podía quedar con mi molestia. Entonces, por eso he venido a pasar con su... Ok, uh. mire, yo, gracias por animarme. <ríe> ok. Y bueno, ah, yo, yo, yo siento que estoy muriendo y estoy animando. <ríe> oh, my God. Ok. No, nah, man, it, it, yeah, the cases are, like, right, going up, supposedly. Mm -hmm. But, uh, you know, like, it's, like, for people that, they don't like follow up instructions they just because they got the shots solo porque tienen ya las dos dosis they say that they can like go out with the face without the face mask mm -hmm. sí, hay muchos que dicen nah, no ya yeah, ya tengo las dos dosis no necesito mascarilla I was like nah you have to use it no en mi trabajo me dijeron ahora váyase para el seguro no me dijeron dos veces <laughs> Yeah, in caso de, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> so let's say Natalie Vanessa, no, nah, she's not here. Romeo, Romeo, no, nah, no here. Rosa del Carmen. Present. Where is Rosa? Ah, Rosa. Hi, Rosa. Why Night don't you? Good night. Why don't you turn on your camera now? You used to turn it on in the classes. Now I see you, but you don't turn it on. Ah, you see. So you see, now it's better to see your face there. Very freshy. <laughs> Good. Uh, Ruth, Joanna. Present teacher. Okay, thank you, Ruth. Uh, Sara Carolina. I think Sara's not here yet. Stephanie Lisette. And I just not here, right? Vanessa Odette. Present teacher. Hi. Still on your way home, Vanessa? Yes, teacher. Uh, uh, sorry, teacher. I am driving. Uh, yes, I mean, uh, that's what I'm telling you, like, like you're on the, on the way home, but de camino todavía a casa. Yes. Okay. All right. Try carefully. Okay. Uh, let's see. William Alberto. Nah, William is not here. Okay, let's keep going. Roxana Yesenia. Hey, neither Roxana. Where is this viewer? Let's see, Nuya Zulema. Present teacher. Ah, okay, good. Jennifer Noemi. Okay, no here. Indiana Gabriela. My God. What happened to these people? They are not getting connected. But anyways, probably they are going to be connecting uh, like later on. Okay, so let's start with the things that we got for today, people. Um, I'm gonna share the presentation that we're gonna have for, for, for today, and it's this. There you go. Can you see my presentation? Just confirm if you can see my presentation. Can you? Yes. Yes. Uh, okay, perfect. So this is the video conference number four, as I told you before. And today we're going to start a very different topic in comparison to the ones that we were practicing all right, in the past. Today we're going to start with the topic, how to use 
be going to. That is the topic, right? That we're going to have for tonight. How to use be going to. All right. What are the main things that we're going to have during this class? Let's see in the class agenda. The first thing that we're going to have is the feedback from the previous class. Okay. Let's start off reviewing the main topic that we were discussing the last class. I mean, yesterday. Okay. And there were like a lot of, a lot of things, a lot of, uh, let me check, let me check. Okay. Good evening. Good evening. Hi, Jorge. Hi. Just give me a second, people. Oh, William is not going to connect you. Okay. So let's just start up with the feedback from the previous class in order to move on with this topic that we're going to have for tonight. So what was the topic that we were discussing yesterday, people? What do we remember from last class? And use the have to, has to. Ah, okay. We were using have to and has to. Uh -huh. What else? I have to for... First, second, uh -huh. a person, uh -huh. yeah, and has to uh, use the third person. Uh -huh. Okay, very good. That was one of the topics, right? Good. Thank you, Nubia. What else? WH word. Okay, we were practicing the WH word, right? Questions with the, with the topic. Okay, good. Carla, what else were we discussing specifically yesterday? Um, can information and pos possibility. Now, nah, okay, we were also practicing can for information and possibilities. Okay, yes. very good. There you go, Carla. Thank you. Eric, can you give me an example question using can? And in this case, I want ever to answer that question the one that you're going to 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 ask so let's see if we remember right you can choose whether choosing you know like a just no question or an information question it's up to you eric Uh-huh. <laughs> Eric. Sorry, <laughs> tenía el micrófono apagado. <laughs> yes. Uh -huh. uh, well, what is it? Este W question. Yes. Vamos a ver. Mm -hmm. Uh, where can where can she drive? Uh, where can she where can she huh? to practice drive? Donde puede practicar y manejar. Where can she practice driving? Driving. Uh huh. Uh, okay. Where can she practice driving? Mm -hmm. When she can practice driving. Where? Or when? When or where? 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 I, I heard where. Uh huh. Where? Okay. She can practice driving on the driving school, I don't know, or <laughs> this the, the the free street. No, okay, all right. Oh, 
yeah, in a school or in a parking lot. Okay. Mm -hmm. There you go. Okay. So let's see. Eric, I want you to give me uh no, you participated already. Ever, I mean, ever, I want you to give me an example question and I want Fatima to help me out giving the answer. Let's start off with a just no question, just, just to see the structure, if you remember. A WH, the WH question. No, I, I just no question. Do you remember I just, a just, just no question, yeah. I just no question, okay. Uh, Fatima, can you, Acomodar, como era la palabra. Can you pick up? No. Pile up. Pile up. Okay. Yeah. Can you pile up the crystal cristalería? Can you up? Can you pile up? Can you pile up? The book in the stand? It's not cristalería, as you said? No, no. I changed it. Why? Can you pile up? <laughs> Can you pile up the book in the stand? I don't know. Yeah. Uh, yes, I can. I can pile up the book in the stand. Pile up. Up. Pile up. up. File up. Now, okay, very good. Thank you, Eric. By the way, Eric, I mean, ever, uh, I think, I think, cristalería, like the word that you were saying, and like when you didn't practice, is like, like a uh, glassware. I'm already yes. done it here. I'm already done it here. I'm gonna send it through the chat. Glass. Like this. That's cristalería, glassware. Okay, that's what it is. Okay, and let's remember the structure that we were practicing last class. Okay, it was can. Okay, using can for information, and what else? Information and what? Okay. Possibilities. I'm possibility. Okay. And, and possibility. Remember, we got two types of questions. When we ask questions with, with Ken, we got a yes or no question, right? And we got WH questions or open questions or information question, if you wanna call them like that. With the just no question, remember, we start the question with can. Example, can you, okay, store the material? Can you store the material? Yes, I can, if it is positive, right? I can store the, material okay if it is no no i can't i can't store the material that's a negative answer right remember okay one of the things that i want you to remember in this case with this structure is that it is the same structure for first person second person and third person. What happened? In here, we don't change the auxiliary verb or we don't change the main verb in third person. It remains the same, it's the same, okay? Check this out, the, the, check this, this, this example. Let's see, can she, you see? Can she, we don't put an extra word or an extra letter to the auxiliary verb can. Can she 
drive a car. You see? It doesn't change. Okay? So, if it is positive, yes. She can. She can drive a car. If it is negative, no. She can't. Okay? She can't drive a car. So, those ones, remember, those are yes, no question, right? That's the name that we put to this, to this type of a structure. Yes, no question. What about with the WS questions? This one provides an additional information. Remember, they provide additional information. Example, where can you... Check this out. Where can you buy good pupusas, for example? Where can you buy good pupusas? In Oriente, of course. Perhaps. Don't say no, Eric. All right. Where can you buy good. pupusas? All right. Now, let's see. You can buy good pupusas in let's imagine let's let's put a place okay let's remember why a place porque acá un lugar esto es lo que nos está pidiendo la pregunta un lugar en específico okay starting with the with the wh word where okay Let's keep that on mind. Another example, check this out. So you can say like, let's see, when can she, um, let's see, finish the report. Where can she finish the report? So this is, this is a question asking about something very specific. And it is not about the activity. It's the time of the day in which that activity finished. Okay? So you can say, she can finish the report, okay, uh, in three days. You see, in three days. That is an answer, right? Okay. ¿Cuándo puede ella terminar el reporte? Ah, ella puede terminar el reporte en tres días. So you see, we are like expressing fine there, okay, the specific information that is being asked in the question. All right, cool. I don't know if you have any question related to this. No sé si tenemos alguna duda con respecto a este tipo de estructuras because if, if you have questions or doubts just let me know like right now before we move on any question? nope no okay good if you don't have questions let's continue so just let me eliminate this part because I'm going to move on Okay, that was part of what we were uh, discussing yesterday, right? So that's the feedback from the previous class. Right after the feedback, we're gonna have like, like some question uh, uh, structures and we're gonna start with the be going to explanation. Para que funciona, okay, on how to create questions, positive statements and negative statements. We're gonna do that. Then we're gonna show some examples then you are going to create some example exercises and then we're gonna go to the manual to work there, okay? And that's pretty much what we are going to have today or what we have today, okay? So let's move on, let's continue. Questions to discuss. Let's start with some questions, all right? Related to what we got in our jobs. Ever help me out reading the question?
what are the different types of delivery service in the country? Okay, can somebody tell me what are like the different types of delivery service in this country? Do you know them? Full. Uh -huh. Okay, that might be one, all right? Like, like related to food, uh -huh. that they can carry food from one place to another. But in this case, Eric, we're talking about like the different types of, okay, let me see, delivery services. One of them is food, as you told, and the rest, what about the rest? Or in this case, take a delivery service as, as listen up, as the service or the company that is in charge of transporting packages or all type of things or materials to other, like, you know, places. So what are like the type of delivery services that you can find or that your companies, the places that you work, use? DHL. Nah, okay. Mm -hmm. now, that can be one. What else? What other companies do you know that they, like, you know, transport products from, from one place to another one? In the mall, pedidos ya. Pedidos ya. Okay, that, that one, like, that, that's a company, right? I heard about that. In here, it's like not that common. But UPS. I guess, uh, but I guess it's a Salvador too. It's very easy. Okay. Good, Jorge. What else? UPS. Aha. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Okay. What do they do? Uh, maybe Trans Express is another one. Trans Express. Yes. Ah, they they packages. It's different. No, it, it is part because I mean what they do is that's the service that they provide, right? That they transport packages from one place to another, maybe from one company to another, or from companies okay to 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 abroad to other countries, right? Okay. Okay. Those are like the main one, right? Pharmacy teacher, pharmacy or medicamentos, you say? Uh-huh, that can be another one, but in this case, uh -huh, they, they got their own delivery, right? Repaid, Fontane, Fontane Vieta. Mm -hmm, that's another one. Uh-huh, those are like the ones, right? Uh, what else? Uh, Mercandu, it's new, it's new in the, in the, the room, in the, in the service, Mercandu. Ah, Mercandu. What do they yes. do? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> no, but they, they, they do they, I, I don't know, like offer, you know, like to, to transport products from one place to another or something like that? Uh, similar Amazon, eBay, uh, delivery service. Amazon? Mm. Yes, is. Uh, re, 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 realmente es muy nuevo aquí en el país. Mm -hmm. oh, I didn't know about that. Wow. That's a new way then, like you, you know, like to order products. And that's yes. cool. That's, that's nice. Now, okay. What are the delivery services your company use? Let me start off with uh, okay. Uh, in, in, parking, your case, in your case, parking, parking oh. using the the the, HP, the UPS and uh -huh. FedEx. Ah, and FedEx. Ah, yeah, I mean that that's another one, right? Very well known. Okay, good. Eric, how about your case? In in my company, use the delivery service uh, of. Um, Aeroflash okay. Aero. Aero Aero to send in the package uh, from the store see me to the clients on your house. Ah, okay, that's, that's, that's good. Okay, that's one of them, right? 
Good. Uh, Hilmar, in your case? In the country, the service, food, the over, over, uh, this service in transit press. Uh -huh. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. That's yeah, <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. Let's see. Is are are you connected, Carlos? Are you there? Carlos? Okay, I think he's not there. He's not connected. Okay, so let's see Vanessa. What is like 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 the, the delivery service that in your company, you know, like your company use the most? Um, no, teacher, no, I am I not delivery service. Uh, really? You don't have like the delivery service? No, um, no, no teacher. Mm, nah, okay, okay. No, I mean, there are companies that they don't, they, they don't do that, right? Okay, uh, Carla, how about your case? Uh, um, the service and container and merks. Ah, okay. I mean, yeah, you work with containers, right? Yes. All those type of things. Those are like kind of big yes. things. I guess they're like sent by ship. Yes, teacher. Mm -hmm. Okay, cool. Maritimo y terrestre. That's very really nice. Okay. Are like, you work in the mer in mirrors? Mm, no, I work in um, what um, servicing containers. Oh, okay, okay. Servicing containers. No, okay. That's really nice. So let's see the last, the last participation related to these questions. Fatima? In your company, uh, what is In my like company, use service food in, in DHL. DHL? Mm, okay, good. All right. Yeah, I mean another one that, that transport like like services or, or I used to transport services is like like, like this company that, that that serves as security too and they transport money. What is the name of it? I think it's Cersa Prosa. Yeah, I mean that's another one, right? That they, they they are in charge of you know like moving money from from bank to bank, from place to place, right? Even they they they, they got money for, for for companies like hard hard you know, like hardware stores. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's pretty cool. Okay, so uh, taking apart that thing, let's start out with the structure that we got for tonight. The uses of be going to, or how to use be going to. Check this out. Do you remember that, I don't remember it was in a phase, I mean, in a, module two or module three that we were uh, discussing this topic, but it was like kind of, a, you know, like not that, it was like kind of general that we were doing. So be going to is similar, okay, is similar to will. It's likely similar to will. Why? Because we use going to to talk about future actions. Okay, that's the main use that we got about be going to. And take, check this out. So we use be going to, listen up, to talk about future actions, as I told you, right? That's why I'm telling you is likely similar to will. All right, why? Because we use it to talk about future events, okay? That are not happening in the moment but they are going to happen in the future, okay? So let's start out with some examples. Hmm. Let's see who can read the example 
Uh, 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 uh. Someone, Ana Garcia, are you there? I am going to prepare the presentation. Okay, prepare. Prepare. Okay, the thank presentation. you. Okay, very good. I am going to prepare the presentation. Okay, in this case, check this out. In this case, the action of that example is being done in the future. It is talking about an action that has not happened yet, but in the future, okay, that action will, uh, you know, like do an effect. So, prepararé una presentación o prepararé la presentación. So, in that case, we're talking about a future action, right? Another example, Carlos, help me a reading. Good evening. Good evening. She is going to visit her relatives next week. Okay, thank you. She's going to visit her relatives next week. Okay, that's another example, right, that we got from this structure. Now, this example is in third person. If you take a look in there, what it changes is the form of the verb be. Remember, when we got the verb be, and we got the, you know, like the, the pronouns, depending on the pronouns that you have in the sentence, is the way of the verb be, is the form of the verb be that you have to use. For example, remember that with I, you use the form of the verb be am. So you see, I am, all right? With you, you got the, the form of the verb be are. Okay, for he, she, and it, you use is, okay, because it is singular. And for we, they, and are in plural nouns, we use are as well, okay? So let's, let's, let's see the structure. But we got one more. Jonathan, help me out this one. You are going to work until late today. Okay. You're going to work until late today. Okay, like, trabajarás hasta tarde ahora. So you see, in that case, it's a future action because the day is not finished. Okay. So these ones are like the most common examples that we can have about this structure. Right after you write down that examples or those examples, we're gonna start up with, uh, to see the grammar part, the structure. What do we need to, to, to make sentences with this uh, structure? So take notes about that if you're taking. Uh, let me know when you finish so I can move on. Hmm. Let me check how many people do I have right now? Four, eight, 12, six, 15. Okay. There you go. Have you finished? Finish. Okay, cool. So let's continue. Now take a look at the structure. This is the structure for positive statements. Okay. Check this out. We got the subject at the beginning of the sentence. Okay, the subject. Remember that the subject can be a pronoun or a proper noun. A pronoun like I, you, he, she, it, okay, we and they, as a pronoun, okay? Or proper nouns like Jorge, like, you know, like Helmer. So those are like proper nouns, okay? Or even we can mention the name of animals too, like the dog, the cat, okay? And then we got be going to. That is a structure, okay, that we need to make future, future. Okay, and remember, we're not gonna write be like, like the one it, it is there. We are going to write the form of the be depending on the subject, okay? And then after the be going to, 
we have the main verb or the verb that indicates the action, okay, that you are going to talk about. And then we have a complement, okay? Remember that the complement is used to make the sentence more specific. That's it. So we got some examples. Vanessa, help me a reading this example. I am going to send emails tomorrow. Okay, thank you. So if you take a look in there, the subject is I. The form of the B is am, and then you got going to, okay? It doesn't change, going to, and the main verb is send, okay? And the complement is emails tomorrow, okay? That is the grammar part in those examples. A second example, check this out. Uh, let's see, Ruth. Can you help me a reading, please? Ruth, are you there? Hello? No, okay, I think she's not there. Uh, Maritza, help me a reading. Ah, yeah, Maritza is like kind of sick, right? Probably she, she, she's, she's not in conditions. Okay, Fatima, help me a reading, please. Teacher. Ah, are you there? I, I, I am, I'm here, teacher. Okay, okay. You are okay. going to finish the report in two hours. Now, okay, thank you. So in that case, we are talking about future actions, right? How? because the report is not finished yet. When is it going to be finished? In two hours. So that's still future, right? So that's why we use be going to. Like you are going to finish the report in two hours. Like terminarás el reporte en dos horas. So you see that's, that in that case we're talking about future. Fatima, help me out with this. She is going to do the homework tonight. Now, okay, thank you. She's going to do the homework tonight, right? So probably I, I said that in the morning. Probablemente eh, estemos diciendo esta oración en la mañana, mediodía o en la tarde. Pero como estamos diciendo que hará la tarea cuando? Esta noche. Okay, so in that case, probablemente eh, el tiempo no ha llegado. Por eso estamos hablando todavía en futuro, okay, in future. There you go. Let's read the next example, Romeo. Okay. He's going to watch TV next week. Okay, thank you. So he is going to watch TV next week. So that is an action that is going to be done next week, not right now, okay? Not in the simple present, but next week. Okay, I think you got the last, that's the last one. So this is related to positive statements, okay? Using first person and third person. Now, with these examples and the structure that we were discussing in there, like whether we were reading, do you have any question with this structure in positive? Or do you understand this structure? How to create positive statements? Do we understand it? Tenemos alguna duda o todos va quedando claro con relación a estas a esta estructura en positivo? Claro, como la horchata. <laughs> cool, that's what I like. Like coffee, man. Like coffee. I need coffee right now. Yeah. Okay, so let's see. Let's see if you have understood this thing. Let's do one example, okay? Let's do it in first person. Let's start in first person. Let's give me an example using future action, okay? Depending on you. Tell me, what are you going to do tomorrow? For example, in my case, I am going to work tomorrow at 7 a.m. That is my example. 
Give me your example. Who's going to be the first one? I'm going to to go mm -hmm. to the beach on week weekend. Next weekend. Okay, next week. The next weekend. Okay, very good. Thank you, Jonathan. That is a future action. Okay, good. Who else? I'm going to go to Zacatecoluca on weekend. Next weekend or on weekend? On, on weekend. Okay, but this is los fines de semana. Mm -hmm. Is como iré a Zacatecoluca los fines de semana? Mm -hmm. Okay, good. There you go. Thank you, Eric. No quise decir San Miguel porque no, mejor sacate. Ay, porque le da insolación. Se va a desmayar. <laughs> Eric, okay, uh, next volunteer. Me. Okay, go. I going I tomorrow. Am... I am I am, I am going to uh -huh. uh, hacer. Ha mm -hmm. Do. do okay do uh, uh, partial tomorrow <laughs> okay a partial oh in this case if you're talking about uh test, exam, test it will be test or midterm. Ah, midterm midterm okay yes thank you okay i am going to do a midterm tomorrow good thank you Jorge. any other volunteer me teacher Okay, first uh, Carla and then Nubia. Okay, I am going to work the weekend. Trabajaré el fin de semana, that's what you want to say? Yes. Okay, I am going to work next weekend. Next weekend. No, okay. Okay. Cool, thank you, Carla. Nubia? Thank you. Okay. Then I am Hilmar. Going... Uh -huh. I'm going to town hall tomorrow in the morning. Repeat again, Anuya. I am going to town hall. I A uh, city hall. Oh, okay, city hall. I mean, I mean, you mean you mean like iré a la alcaldía mañana in the morning. Ah, ok, pero ahí le falta el verbo a uh, Nubia. Léamela de nuevo. I'm going to City Hall. I am going to... Recuerde que el going to solo es la estructura para formar el ah. futuro. Después del going to tiene que ir el verbo. ¿Y cuál es el verbo, Nubia? ¿Cuál es la... ¿Cómo se dice ir en inglés? Go. Ah, okay. I'm going to go. Yes. City hall. To the city to, hall. To the city hall. Tomorrow to morning. morning. Okay. Ah, okay. Very good. Thank you, Nubia. Hilmar, you were about to participate. I heard you turn on the, the, the microphone. I'm going to move to Madrid. Okay, repeat again. I'm going to. I am going to. I am going to move to Madrid. Ah, okay, very good. Teacher. People with money, right? Okay. Uh -huh, hey there. I'm going to watch my favorite series tonight. There After you go. That. Yes, man. Very good. Any other volunteer? Me teacher. Okay. I am going to study for the exam that the tomorrow. Tomorrow. Okay. There you go. I'm going to study for the exam tomorrow. Hmm. Good. Who else? Who else wants to participate? Alguien más? Yo teacher. I am going to 
Okay, first Anna and then Fatima. Anna, turn on the, the camera, please. I want to see you. Okay. There you go. I am going to visit my sister next week. Weekend. Very good. There you go. And happy birthday. That's what you got on the back. My sister. Estaba en celebración, por eso es que no, no quería encender la cámara. Ah, solo no. para no enseñarnos el pastel, para no mandarnos pastel, ¿verdad? Right? No, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so happy birthday to your sister, Anna. Right? And thank you for the example. So, Fatima, let's read. I am going to write the report tomorrow. Okay, I am going to write the report tomorrow. Thank you, Fatima. There you go. Uh, let's see who else gets in here. Ruth, are you there? And let's see if she's there. Ruth, hello. Teacher. Yes. Can you give me the example uh, that you have? Um, I have to watch bathroom. Uh, in that case, it has to be with the structure that you have in there, Ruth, with the going to. Um, I am going to watch. Mm -hmm. um, close, ropa. <laughs> okay, close. I am going to watch close. No, okay. <laughs> That's what women wear, right? Okay, good. Thank you. So, well, well, well. Ah, uh, Carlos, did you do the example? Um, for example, she's going to arrive early tomorrow at work. Okay, or she's going to arrive in this case. The pronunciation is arrive. But arrive. It's, yeah, but the structure is okay. Thank you, Carlos. Good. Uh, okay. okay. Jennifer, are you there? Yes, teacher. I call it interest. Um, oh, really? Okay. Uh -huh. okay. Oh, Let's try. Me dormí, teacher. <laughs> really? I mean, you you were the one that that, that told me that that, that is sick, right? Yes, me duele mucho la cabeza, pero lo voy a intentar. He is okay. uh, he's going to dance with with him him brother his brother yes okay thank you jennifer yeah i mean that's correct he's going to try i mean to dance with his brother okay romeo okay uh, i'm going to cook tonight okay if you don't cook, <laughs> you don't need right now. Okay, so I am going to cook tonight. Good, Romeo. Let's see who else has not participated. Mm -mm -mm. Who told me that we sick? William? Are you there, William? Or are you still working? Yes. Are you there or are you still working? Yes, uh, I work because what is the question? Uh, okay, okay. Uh, did you do the example or could you give me an example related to this? The last. Yeah, I mean like, like an example related to this. Okay, he is going to watch TV next week. No, okay, now, one from your own. Ahora, 
Tomando como base esa. Hágame un ejemplo usted. Ok. Uh, she's, she's going to buy. She's uh, going to buy. Uh -huh. A new shoe. A new shoes. Ok. Or a yes. new pair of shoes. Ok. Thank you, William. Ah, she's going to buy a new pair of shoes. Ay, comprará zapatos nuevos. Yeah, I mean, that's normal on women. That's why uh, William says she. Okay, let's continue with this then. So this one is, is remember, in if, uh, positive statements. Teacher. Hello? No me quiso preguntar. And me Hey, what time do you ya no love? existo para usted. No, ya no quiero. Why not? Because you got the camera off, you see? Ahora ya no la puedo <laughs> ver. Miren si me enciende la cámara. Yo no, no. sé si está ahí. Es ¿Cómo que... no? Me ve conectada. Anda toda rebelde ahora. Huh? Ay, sí. <laughs> hey, what about uh, Natalie? Why didn't she connect, get connected? Ah, sí, no. Ahora no se va a poder conectar porque ha fallecido un familiar de ella entonces oh, um, okay. ajá, no, no puede ah, ok, ok good, so give me your example I am going to cook the lunch for tomorrow ok, very good so that you are expressing future action right, ok, cool so let's continue with uh, negative statements ok, now let's do the opposite we were practicing positive statements, now with negative statements. And this is the structure. If you take a look at the structure, it's likely similar to the structure in positive statement. What is the difference? That in here, after B, we have not. That is the only difference. That in here, after B, we have not. Okay, and that's it. Examples. Uh, Jorge, help me out reading. I am not going to buy a new cell phone. Ah, okay, if you take a look in there, in positive statement, it will be, I am going to buy a new cell phone. That would be positive. Negative, I no. am not going to buy a new cell phone. What makes the difference? Only the word not, no. that's it. Good. Fatima, okay, may I read in the second example? You are not going to drive the car. Okay, very good. If you take a look, it's likely similar, right? Just put not between the verb be and going to. It's in the middle, right? Sí, pero si acá solo se le pone el not entre el, entre el verbo to be y el going to. Exactly. And you have a negative statement. Y ahí okay. ya podemos formar una oración en negativo. Yeah. Just by adding not. ¿Por qué no necesitamos un verbo auxiliar? Porque recuerden que el verbo to be prácticamente actúa como verbo principal y como verbo auxiliar también. Ok. Aunque en este caso está más actuando como un auxiliar. Ok. Por eso es que ya no necesitamos de otro auxiliar ok simplemente por eso colocamos not there you go so we got another example Carla help me read this example he is not going to sell the product ok very good he is not going to send the product so take a look at that Okay, in third person, it's likely the same. Okay, right after is, it's not, and then going to, and then the main verb. And that in this case is send. Okay, he is not going to send the product. And we got a negative statement. Okay, cool. Now on a row, I want an example, but in this case, just putting not. Okay, I must start with Eric. Eric, give me an example. I'm gonna be calling one by one. I am not going to 
to send the package uh, tomorrow. Okay, good. Bien. Para los demás, thank you, Eric. Para los demás, piens, piensen en una oración en este momento, en negativo, ¿ok? Voy a dejar de compartir un momento para pasar asistencia. Give me a second. I'm going to pass the sentence list like right away and then we can continue. So, Ana Claribel. Present. Good. Ana Maria. Present. Where is Ana Maria? Ah, what time did you get connected? I just saw there and you were not there. <laughs> okay. Aquí estoy. <laughs> okay, good. Ah, uh, Carlos Ademir. Present teacher. Okay, good. Er Guillermo. Present teacher. Excellent. Ever de Jesús. Present. Very nice. Fatima Alejandra. Present. Okay, good. Elmar Cruz. Present. Very nice. Ah, uh, Jonathan uh, Alexander. Ok, Jorge Elber. Present. Ok, nice. Carla Benacer. Present. Ok, cool. Margot Hernández. What did you got Margot in here? No. Ok. Eh, Ma Maritza Alcira. Present teacher. Ok, nice. Natalie Vanessa is not going to connect. Romeo Alexis? Present. Okay, good. Uh, Rosa de Carmen? Present. Okay, good. Uh, Ruth Joanna? Ruth Joanna? Are you there? Present teacher. Ah, okay. Thank you. Sara Carolina. Mm, Sara is not here. Okay. And Stephanie Lisset. Present. Okay, nice. Vanessa Odette. Present teacher. Okay, good. William Alberto. Present. Ok, nice. Roxana Yesenia. I just saw Roxana there. Roxana, are you there? Present teacher. Ah, ok. Good. No, yes, Lema. Present teacher. Ok, good. Jennifer Noemi. Present. Ok, and the last one. Diana Gabriela, which is not here. It's weird. She's not here. That's the second day that she's not here. Okay, let's continue. So let me see. Eric did the first example. Now I want Nubia to read the second example for me. Nubia, read your example using a negative statement. Would be going to. What teacher? Give me the example that I told you to think about using negative statements with be going to. Okay. I am going no I am not going to gym this week. I am not <laughs> going, going to gym. Remember, we need an extra verb. We need the verb. To go. <laughs> uh -huh. Repeat again. I am not going to go gym. To the gym. This week. To the this gym. Week. This week. <laughs> okay, very good. Thank you, Nubia. Fatima, give me your example. I am not going to sleep early today. <laughs> okay, good. Thank you, Fatima. Now, Rosa. Mm. 
Rosa. Read your example for me. She is not going to visit her parents. Okay. His parents. Not her parents. If you say she is her parents. Okay, her parents. Okay, thank you, Rosa. Jorge. <coughs> I I am not going to let you forget it. It. Mm, okay. Okay. Good. Romeo. I am not going to sleep. Sería, going to sleep. Going to sleep. Uh -huh. early. early. Okay, very good, Romeo. Carla. I am not going to send the container. Okay, very good. Ever. I am not going to I am not going to leave my mic on. My I am not going to leave my microphone on. Uh, I am not going to turn turn my microphone on. Turn. Okay. Turn. T U R N. Turn. Oh, okay. okay. Thank you. Helmer? Uh, I am not going to play soccer tonight. No, okay, very good, Helmer. Jennifer? I am, not, I am not going to work tomorrow. No, okay, good. There you go, Jonathan. La misma oración había hecho. I'm sorry, Jonathan. Copy paste. Copy paste. Ah, se dieron copia. Uh, Vamos a repartir uh, 0.50 para cada uno. Ah, I am not, not going to going to, to buy. Ajá. Uh -huh. I'm going to buy a new notebook. Okay, new notebook. Good, Jonathan. Now, Ana Maria. Let's read your example. No se me quitaba el miedo. Eh, she is not going to eat pupusas today. So sad. Okay, good. There you go. Ah, uh, Carlos, read your example. Uh, I am not going to give the presentation next week. Okay, perfect. Vanessa. Okay. I am not. I am not going to wash clothes tomorrow. Wash the clothes tomorrow. Okay, very good. Okay, uh, let's see who else was Ana Garcia. I am not going to drink coffee tonight. No, okay, very good. Mrs. Urrutia. No, sé si está bien, teacher. Okay, read it. I am not going to open the camera in class. <laughs> <laughs> when? When? Yeah. I mean, she's a rebel now. Okay. Nice. <laughs> I'm going to give it the neck. That's why. <laughs> okay. Uh, Maritza, do you do the example? Maritza. Hello. Okay, I think she's not there. Uh, let's see. Ruth, are you there? 
Teacher, um, I'm not going to continue the class. I feel bad. I need sleep. Uh, okay, okay. Uh, yeah, I mean, I, I, I listen to you and you're kind of sick. All right, Ruth. So, like the example, like, I am not going to continue the class. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> All right, Ruth, I hope you feel better, okay? Thank you, teacher. Okay. William? Okay. Um, we are not going to build mm -hmm. the house. Okay, very good. Thank you, okay. William. And okay. the last example is for Roxana. Um, um, I am not going to Limonate. Um, um, poca, ¿cómo se dice, teacher? Ah. Poca azúcar. Ah, <laughs> sorry. Le, le, escuché, le escuché otra cosa. Coca. <laughs> no, no, but from Coca-Cola, right? From Coca-Cola, right? No, no, no. Poca. Poca azúcar. Sí. O con poquita azúcar. With a little, uh -huh. a little bit of sugar. Little uh, sugar. Ah, entonces sería I am not limonate. Eh, eh, is pero, um, little eh, sugar. No haré limonada o no tomaré limonada o, o con poca azúcar o con más, con más, con más. Ajá, que este, que no me gusta la limonada, que no tomo, no tomo limonada con poco azúcar. <laughs> Okay, okay, listen up. I am not going to. Okay, I am. Uh -huh. Okay, no, but in this case, uh -huh, I am not going to. In this case, instead of using do, it's make. I am not going make. to make a lemonade. A lemonade? With. A little sugar, a, a little sugar. Ah, uh, okay, teacher. Good, Roxana. <laughs> you like the lemon, okay. a lot of sugar. Okay. Yeah, I mean, if I drink sugar, it's like, uh, I become very hyperactive. Es como cuando los niños comen dulce, and they're like moving from one place to another. That happens to me. <laughs> Okay, let's move on. So here we got be going to with yes and no question. Now the structure changes. Why it changes? Because in here we can like practice, okay, this structure with questions. And specifically, just no questions. And this is the structure. Check this out. En este caso, en la estructura es diferente. Cambia un poco. En qué aspecto? Se mueven algunas partes. Okay, that's it. The first part is that we put be at the beginning. Recuerden que en be puede ser am, is, or are, dependiendo del subject. Okay, depending on the subject. So we got be plus subject plus going to plus main verb plus complement. And at the end, the question mark. Examples. Ana Maria, read the example. Are you going to play soccer tomorrow? Okay, are you going to play soccer tomorrow? Good. Check this out. Yes, no answer. If it is positive, yes, I am. And that's it. Lo vamos a dejar así corto, okay? Yes, I am. Y ustedes pueden continuar. I am going to play soccer tomorrow, if it is uh, positive. If it is negative, no, I'm not. Ah, by the way, the apostrophe is missing between I and, and, the, and the M, right? Am. So, no, I'm not, okay? I'm not going to play soccer tomorrow. 
So does like the negative uh, okay, form to that question. Recordemos que entonces acá, para una just no question, tenemos que iniciar siempre con el verbo be. Si acá tuviese she en vez de you, ¿cuál sería acá? ¿Sería are? Is. Yeah, in that case, sería is. Ok, very good. So, let's move on. Because we got some ex extra examples. Hilmar, help me reading this question. Okay. Is she going to store the products? Okay, very good. Is she going to store the products? Romeo? Read, Romeo. Yes, she is. Okay, if it is positive. If it is negative? No, she, no, she isn't. No, she isn't. Very good. Thank you, Romeo. Uh, who can help me already? Let me see. Jennifer, read. Are Laura and Angel? Angel, Angel uh huh. Or Angel? Angel going to read the article. 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 Okay. Are Laura and Angel or Angel going to read the article? So we got two people in there, right? Por eso llevamos R, porque tenemos dos personas ahí, like two people. That's plural, okay? Are Laura and Angel going to read the article? So check this out, the answers. Vanessa. Yes, they are. Okay, and if it is negative? No, they aren't. Very good. Yes, they are. And no, they aren't. Very good. So this is related with, listen up, with just no questions only. With just no questions. I'm going to strike. Uh, I'm going to make some questions like this try to, uh, to people. Like Jorge. Jorge. Hello. Are you going to take a shower tomorrow? Yes, I am. <laughs> <laughs> okay, very good. Eric. Yes, are, teacher. Are you going to share memes tomorrow? Mm. Yes, I am. <laughs> yes, I am. Le <laughs> okay. iba a decir, yo no hago eso, pero... <laughs> ajá, ajá, sure, sure. Y iba a mentir. That. Uh -huh. Exactly. Okay. Ah, yeah, yes. Ana Maria. Ana why not? Maria. That you I mean, me. Why not? Of course, man. <laughs> so, Ana Maria. Uh -huh. is, 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 is Carla going to prepare breakfast next week? Is Carla? Is Carla going to prepare breakfast next week? Yes. Uh, she eats. Uh -huh. If it is negative? No. Uh, she is not. Okay, very good. There you go. Okay, now, Hilmar. Yes, it's bigger. Is ever going to drink Coca Cola tonight? Uh, yes, he is. Yes, he is. Okay, there you go. So, Carla, let's check Carla. Is Roxana going to fall asleep early? Yes, she is. Okay, yes, she is. Okay, good. So let's 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 practice the last with the last question. Let's see. Jennifer. Is Stephanie going to turn on the camera? Stephanie, 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 Stephanie. <laughs> is uh, is no, is she uh -huh. isn't. Right. Definitely, right? Yeah. <laughs> That's why I'm going to in the module. <laughs> okay, thank you, Jennifer. So those are, remember, those are just no questions. 
starting with the verb be. Depending on the subject that you put in there is the answer that you're gonna give, all right? Or is the way of the verb be that you're gonna put at the beginning. If you have um, remember, if you, ha if you have I, the first question, okay, is um, so am I, am I going to send a text message? Okay, so if, if you go with the you, remember it's with R. So it's like, are you, okay? Is he, is she, are we, like as a group, are they, okay? That's the way how we use that structure. Now let's move on to information questions. Remember this one is different because in this case, you don't use only just no answer. In here, we have to provide a specific information and this is the structure, okay? What do we add in here? We just add the WH word. And remember the WH words are what, what time, what kind of, where, when, who, why, okay? Those are like the, the most common WH words that we use. And we got some examples in here. Oh, let's see. Is this Rutia? Read the first question. The first question? Yes. <laughs> okay. Where is the company going to set the package? Okay. Thank you. There you go. Thank Where you. is the company? Listen up. Where is the company? Why is? Because you get the subject, the company, and it is singular, right? Where is the company going to send the packages? Okay. Uh, Jonathan, read the answer. The company is going to send the pack packages to Mexico. Hello? To Mexico. Okay, very good. The company is going to check this out. The company is going to send the packages to Mexico. There you go. So in that case, we are providing additional information. Aquí ya estamos dando información adicional, dependiendo, claro, está de la WH word que utilicemos. Okay, depending on it. Recordemos que acá esta está enfocada en el lugar donde se dará la actividad o a donde se dirige la, eh, o el final de la actividad, por así decirlo, right? The location, because we use where. Now, let's read some extra examples. Rosa, are you there? Read the question. Rosa, Rosa, are you there? Did you fell asleep? Okay, I think she lost the battle. <laughs> there you go. Ever, tell me a reading. Okay. What time are you going to have the meeting? Okay, there you go. What time are you going to have the meeting? Check this out. Uh, William, help me a reading. Okay. Uh, I am, I am going to have uh -huh. the meeting at yes. 3 p.m. At 3 p.m., okay, very 3, good. At 3 p.m. Very good, thank you, William. So I am going to have the meeting at 3 p.m. So in that case, we're asking about a specific time, okay? Aquí estamos preguntando una hora en específico en el que esa actividad se llevará a cabo in the future. Okay. Next example question. Vanessa, tell me a read. When is he going to buy to buy a, a new car. Okay, when is he going to buy a new car? There you go, thank you. And the here, my, read the answer. He is going to buy a new car the next month. Yeah, okay, very good. He's going to buy a new car next month. So recordemos, en este caso, cuando usamos when, para futuro, vamos a, a, a utilizar las expresiones de tiempo que indican futuro. ¿Cuáles son? Tomorrow, 
tonight, next week, next weekend, next month, next year. Those are like the most common ones. Esas son como las más comunes que tenemos, okay? When we use when. Okay. Uh, until here, people, do we have any question? Hasta acá, ¿tenemos alguna pregunta? Con respecto a este, a este tipo de preguntas, a la estructura de este tipo de preguntas. Y yes, eso. No? De acuerdo a la WH, eh, vamos a responder el complemento. Dependiendo de la WH word que tengamos, así va a ser el tipo de respuesta eh, exacto y quedaremos firmas. Si estamos usando where, recordemos, ahí con where sería el lugar que vamos a dar en la respuesta. Ok. Example. Where is he going to go tomorrow? Where is he going to go tomorrow? So you might say, he is going to go to Santa Ana tomorrow. So Santa Ana in that case is the answer. Entonces, básicamente, la palabra ahí, Santa Ana, ya es la respuesta a la pregunta, ¿ok? Que se está dando ahí. ¿Why? Porque estamos preguntando sobre un lugar. ¿Ok? Thank you. Yeah, you're welcome. So, another question. It's like, who, listen up, who is Vanessa going to dance with? Who is Vanessa going to dance with? ¿Con quién bailará Vanessa? So we can say, Vanessa is going to dance with Romeo. All right, there you go. Entonces, ¿sobre qué estamos preguntando ahí? No exactamente sobre la acción, sino con quién hará la acción. Who with? ¿Con quién? ¿Ok? Depending on the WH word, dependiendo de la WH word que tengamos, así será el tipo de respuesta que demos. Good. Any other sure. question? Teacher, yes. yeah, you, write this, you write this example in the screen, please. Ah, okay. In Thank a you. moment. In a moment. I'm going to use the notation. Okay, here. Check this out. Who is, what did you say? Vanessa, right? Vanessa going to dance with. Who is Vanessa going to dance with? So the answer, Vanessa is going to dance with. Romeo. There you go. Thank you. Okay. There you go. Take, you can take notes. And Vanessa says, yes. <laughs> Do you like dancing, Vanessa? Yes, teacher. Okay, cool. I mean, I like think everybody likes dancing in here. Do you like dancing, Fatima? Mm, no, teacher. I don't like dancing. Why not? Aha, uh aha. -huh, uh -huh. I'm going to believe you. I'm going to pretend to believe you. We are pretending. Okay, I see. Claro que no, teacher. No. Maybe no me gusta. The general, I don't like. The Maybe the Janet uh, and, dancing. And, and, and in her bedroom, like dancing reggaeton in there. Right? Uh, yeah, okay. Uh -huh. Or women no. like the reggaeton. Uh, yeah, I don't know. most women. Yeah, that's true. That's true. So let, let, let's see. Nubia, how about you? Do you like dancing? What, teacher? Do you like dancing? Um. Yes, but... I, I don't. You can't dance? Why can't you dance? I can't oh, yeah. dance. <laughs> That's what you said now. It's like, 
And then in in uh, in, in in the Paris, it's like, oh, I thought pulmon in there. <laughs> uh -huh. no. Todo, todo, todo lo bailo, pero con el mismo paso. <laughs> okay, okay. I mean, that's typical. That's typical. There you go. Uh, let's see the last one that might be connected in here. Uh, like, like, how about you, Carla and Jennifer? Do you like dancing? Yes or no? Yes, teacher. Cool. I wish I could. Yeah. I love you. Cannot. Ah, okay. All right. Good, Carla. So you got it. And you, Jennifer? I wish I could, but I cannot. You cannot dance? No. No? I, no. Y después de un monster, uh, en la pista con todo. <laughs> yes? Ah, you see, she said yes. Okay. Okay. So, I'm just... Paso prohibido para que me canten el eso, Tilín. <laughs> okay. Okay. That was good. That was a good one. Okay. Okay, people, let's continue. Let me let me erase this part to move on. Okay, what are we gonna do now? Let's work in the manuals. Okay, let's open up the manuals in your cell phones. So if you got them physically, let's open them up because we're gonna be practicing in there. Just give me a second. Just give me a second. I'm gonna put, put it in the screen. There you go. Check this out. What are we gonna do with this information? Right, right after uh, doing the practice that we're gonna do, después, vamos, antes, antes de comenzar la práctica que vamos a hacer, vamos a terminar esta, esta página que tenemos acá. Okay. Vamos a responder estas preguntas. Okay, how are we gonna do that? By reading. It says, Read the shipping label information and answer the question. We got four questions in here. The question number one says, listen, what is the shipping address? What is the mailing address? How many units are in the package? What is the manufacturing date? How are we going to answer those questions from here? Check this out from here. Let's do it from here. It says, check this out, from. It says from Traverse Inc. 23, Glenway, San Carlos, CA, right? 0570, it says made in the US. So this is, okay, this is like, like what? This one. It goes in here. We're gonna do it later on, like this. Let's 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 continue reading. It says tracking number. Do you under, what do you understand by tracking number? What is that? What is a tracking number? Es el regi es el registro o la ruta que lleva el paquete. Ah, okay. There you go. Eso lo veo todos los días, Pichu. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I can't tell. <laughs> I can't tell. All right, the tracking number is, Ever, help me reading. Read the numbers. The number is O O. Okay, it's like P P P P. Okay, continue. <laughs> one, two, O, one, three, four, two, three, three. Three, three. Okay, very good. There you go. Now it says, listen up, quantity. 65 units. What is quantity? Cantidad. Okay, very good. Shipment. Take this out. Shipment. What is shipment? What is the word shipment? Have you ever seen that word before? Envio. Exactly. Envio. Okay. It says 7A4. And it is there to, okay, to the place that is going to arrive. It says, Literal Road, number 34, La Union, El Salvador. 
and you got a number here, right? You got a big number like double zero. Okay, one, two, oh, one, three, four, two, double three. This is like zero one, and you got double zero, right? Again, double zero, double zero, oh, four, three, two, three, two, three. Yeah, it's just, just an example. Okay, and you got sender, right? This is a code from the sender. In this case, the sender is like the company, right? And then it says, what is this? What do you think is this? This is manufacturing date. And what is a manufacturing date? Manufacturing date. Exactly. There you go. Fecha de fabricación. Right? That is a that is a synonym. But it, the, the, the complete word is manufacturing. All right, date. It says, Eric, help me reading this this date. Twelve of April, um, twenty thirteen. Twenty thirteen. Okay, very good. Twenty thirteen or two thousand thirteen. There you go. Any here is listen up net weight net weight what is a net weight el peso exactly right that is 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 like this net weight this is this is the complete word esa sería el, 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 la, la palabra completa net weight okay and the other one is Y la otra eh, que tenemos ahí arribita de la MFG, así es el nombre completo, ¿ok? The complete name. Manufacturing, ¿ok? Net weight. Ok, you got it there, right? Cool. Now that you have that, that information, let's answer this question. Vamos a responder entonces estas preguntas. Let's give number one as an example. It says, what is the shipping address from here? What is the shipping address? Fibers Inc. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay, listen up. Is everything from here? Travers Inc. 23 Glenways and Carlos CA. All right. 0570 made in the US. That's one. All this. Okay, yeah, we need to do this. Okay. So is all this the one that goes in here? Todo eso va en esta parte entonces, like the number one, okay? Cool, bien. Listen, ¿qué vamos a hacer con esta información, con el resto de la información? La vamos a completar acá, dice. What is the mailing address? Okay, vamos a responder acá con la información que tenemos ahí. How many units are there in the package? ¿Cuántas unidades hay en el, en el, en el paquete? And what is the manufacturing date? ¿Y cuál es la fecha de manufactura? Good. Eso lo vamos a hacer, okay, lo vamos a hacer en pequeños grupos que vamos a formar, okay? Entendemos esa parte. Ahora bien, check this out. Después de ello, y lo voy a explicar así de, 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 de una manera un tanto breve, después de ello, vamos a pasar, ok, así mismo con los grupos formados, vamos a pasar a la siguiente página del manual, específicamente a esta parte, que es sobre los usos del Be Going To que hemos estado viendo en los ejemplos anteriores. Y vamos a ordenar, ok, vamos a hacer esta, esta pequeña actividad de acá. Dice... Put the words in order, then answer the question, right? Pon las palabras en orden y luego responde las preguntas. ¿Qué vamos a hacer acá? Listen, acá ustedes tienen una serie de preguntas. Todas son preguntas. ¿Qué vamos a hacer? Están desorganizadas. Lo único que van a hacer es organizarlas acá, de manera correcta. Acá, ¿ok? Después de 
organizarla, what are we going to do? Vamos a darles respuesta acá, en esta sección. In here. Ok. ¿Cómo lo vamos a hacer? Lo vamos a hacer en grupos. Ok. En grupos que voy a formar en este momento. Solo que necesito confirmar, people, todos los que tienen la cámara apagada están ahí. Are you there? Porque necesito yeah. saber, all right? Complete. Let me confirm, please. Sí, teacher, aquí estoy. No, ok. Yes, right. No, yo no estoy. Cool. Teacher, creo que tengo uno. Okay, teacher, porque tengo la cámara apagada, pero aquí estoy. Uh, ok, uh, let's see. Marisa, I, uh, do you continue there? Are you still there? Uh, I guess, I guess, she's there? Yeah, she's there. Okay, perfect. What are we gonna do? Primero vamos a responder como grupo, vamos a responder las, las, las del de la página anterior y luego vamos a pasar a estas, okay? Let me see. I'm gonna give 12 minutes for you to finish. Creo que en 12 minutos lo logramos hacer, ok? So, voy a crear los grupos entonces en este momento. And then we can uh, continue in the breakout rooms. Let me see how many people are there. 19. Ok. Eight. Let me see. Let's put it this way. Let's sign automatically. Let's try. Ok, va a quedar uno de cuatro ya, y los demás de tres. Ok. Rosa, do you continue there? Are you there? Come on, Rosa. Ese, ese dedito pulgar ahí. Ok, let's, let's give us up in there, ok? And, and let's work on it. Entonces, démosle aceptar y vamos, vámonos a trabajar en los breakout rooms. If you have any questions, just let me know, okay? In that part. Let's accept it. And let's go to work. Let's finish that. Uh, that's going to be the last exercise that we're going to be doing. Okay, let's accept. There to enter. All right, so we must accept that Maritza and uh, ah, yeah, William is already there. Okay, so Maritza is uh, missing. ¿Y quién están en el grupo? Sí. Déjeme. Lo voy a compartir ahorita de nuevo. Ajá, ajá. You don't have the manuals. Uh, ¿Cuál era la página usted? Ah. ¿Qué página era? The one that you're going to be working on. You're going to be working in page 16 and 15. Página 15 y 16. Mm -hmm. Primero vamos a trabajar en la 15. Ok, terminando las preguntas. From, from the label y luego vamos a bajar a la página al, ejerci al ejercicio 5 de la página 16 ok, you got it eh, Romeo you have it people <tose> Lo, lo compartí al grupo ahorita para que pueda checar en el WhatsApp, Romeo. No, ahorita, ahorita, pero no. All right, you know what? Eh, para que no perdamos mucho tiempo, si gustan, les comparto esta parte. Solo lo que van a necesitar, le toman una screenshot and you can put it work. ¿Ok? Ok. okay. Esta es de la página 15. Bien. Tomen el screenshot a esta parte, Romeo, porque la va a necesitar. Ya está. 
done? Sí, ya entendí. Ok, y con eso va a responder estas preguntas. Garrett? ¿Ya? Ok, y luego vamos a hacer esta parte. From exercise 5. ¿Got it? ¿Ya la tienes, Romeo? No, ok, cool. So I'm gonna stop sharing. Bien. Eh, Eric, I don't, I don't know if you're working from a computer, Eric. ¿Lo he dicho? Está, eh, está, está en, la, en la videoconferencia desde una computadora. Eh, no. ¿From a cell phone? Estoy, a, estoy aparte, estoy aparte. Ah, ah, ok, ok. Pero ahorita estoy sacando un screenshot y ya la voy a compartir al grupo. Ah, ok, cool. There you go. So let's, 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 let's continue with that. It's not gonna be like, like kind of, uh, you know, like difficult, but let's move on because we had to finish that. Okay, exactly perfect. at 10. At 10. Per perfect okay. teacher, thank Ooh. you. Okay. Hello. Hi teacher. Como vamos? Hello, teacher. Eh, contestando. Estamos ahorita lo de la página 16. Ya las formulamos. Ah, ok. Very good. Yes, teacher. Did you divide, did you divide the, the, the question? Sí, con... Oh, supongo que como grupo se dividieran las preguntas. O todas no, las... O cada quien no. por su lado. No, entre todos. Entre todos. Ajá. Ok. Carlos, you too? Is not there? Yes, yes. No. Nah. Oh, okay. Okay. Ah, okay. Remember, it's from the exercise from the page 15 and the next exercise from the page 17. Okay? Okay. Okay, cool. So exactly at 10, I'm gonna finish, uh, you know, like the participation in these breakout rooms and then we're gonna go back to the main station, okay? Exactly at 10. So it means okay. you've got seven minutes. Okay. Okay, nice. So, put, put the words in order, then answer, answer the question, okay? Number one. Where are they, where they are, where they are going to pick up the package. Uh, read, read, read again, Vanessa. Where there, where they are going to pick up the package? Are you sure? Okay, check this out. I'm gonna take the control from the notes in here. Check this out. Okay. Like the structure to make questions. Remember. La estructura salía WH word okay, plus, word. plus, ok. Plus what? Help me out. Are they going? B <laughs> plus. R. Yes, in the B. Where are they? Plus. Is the R. It's first. First. All right. Plus verb. And at the end, complement. Entonces, esta sería la estructura. ¿You see? Mm -hmm. Entonces, ahí, en vez de decir they are, es are they. Are they. Are they. Ok. Yes. Yes. Are. They are solo es en oraciones afirmativas. Ok. Very good. Ok. Where are they going to pick up the package? The package. Package o package. 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 Okay. Package. The pronunciation is package, right? Yeah. right? Package. Yeah, package. Plural, packages. Packages. Okay. Package. Very good. 
So exactly at 10, I am going to cut off the breakout rooms and we're gonna go to the main section, okay? Exactly okay. at 10. So it means you got five minutes. Okay, thank you. Okay, cool. Okay, guys, in the next step. In the world. What's happening oh, here? Oh. Who, who, who left in here? Quien se fue de acá? No sé, teacher. Solo dos entramos al principio. Eh, Maritza no entró entonces. Maritza a Maritza Alcira. Ah, okay. Okay. All right. No problem. You can Ahorita work. ya la ya están ordenadas, teacher. Hay Perfect. que responder la primera. Perfect. Okay. Yeah. Let's answer. Okay, bam. And who is going to receive the, uh, What is the meaning shipping? Shipping. In view. Re receive. Who is going to receive the shipping? Who is going to receive the shipping? Ah, in that case, it's the person in church or the company in church. Es como, ¿quién recibirá? ¿Quién recibirá el envío? Ajá. El envío. Mm. Ahí en ese caso usted puede poner cualquier, ya sea una empresa o una persona. Porque está dice ¿tú? ¿Quién? ¿No? ¿Ok? Let me check out. Okay. What, 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 what breakout is this? One, two, three. Number four. Uy, ahí viene. Uy. La, tor la tormenta, o qué es lo que ahí viene, viene la tormenta. Ah, come on. Ah. La tormenta la... perfecta. Tormenta huracán, diga, categoría 5. Violento. Violento, violento. Arrasar con todo. Uh, no, teacher. Look at Jennifer. And Jennifer is like, Jennifer is like, like this. With one, one, with one open eye and the other one is like, like this. Close. Mm -hmm. Oh, los palitos de fósforo aquí. Exactly. Y uno atravesado acá para sonreír. Y no, y no es la única, teacher. Si yo ahorita ya no sé ni qué estoy haciendo. Okay. No, no, la, el último, el último, ya, teacher, ya, dos minutos, ya terminamos la clase, fue un gusto verlo, nos vemos sí. mañana. Cool. ¿Terminó los ejercicios? ¿Por qué será la mm. idea? Eh, falta. Good. Solo Entonces, el falta. primero hemos hecho, teacher. El, solo el primero hemos hecho. Why? Porque ah, estamos concentrados, bien, enfocados bien. en hacerlo. Ah, okay. pero seguro. Sí. Good, good, that's, 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 that's the good part. Lentos, pero mm. seguros. Slow but sure about it. <laughs> That's nice. Yeah, I mean, we, mm. we're not going to finish like everything by today, but, but for tomorrow at the beginning of the class, we're going to check that. All that you're doing right now, we're going to check out at the beginning of the class for tomorrow. Mm. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. Yeah like, yeah, like one more minute and I'm going to like finish this breakout rooms, okay? And we're going okay. to okay. go back I'm to the main to section. Mm. We're going to check two more, two more groups. I mean, actually, one more. Pick up the package. Hi, teacher. Hi. Uh, you were supposed to be three people. How about the other one? ¿Qué pasó con la otra persona que se supone que... Ana dice que se le apagó el celular. Oh, that's why. Ah, con razón no me aparecía acá. No, okay. So let me check. I got three. three. Okay, how do you go? ¿Cómo vamos acá? You finish? Este, no. Ordenando no. las oraciones. Tam. No, ok. 
There you go. I think. Let me check. All right. I will just. Pero ni el, ni el, ni el ah. primero mm -hmm. hemos podido hacer así que. <laughs> <laughs> Are you serious? <laughs> this is this is the first one then, and then you go to the next one. Yes. Nah. Okay. Okay. No problem. No problem. I'm just gonna check only one more group and then we finish. Okay. Let and, okay. and let's go back to the main section. Just give me mm. a, one minute to finish this this breakout room. Okay. Cool. Hello, mm. people. Did you finish? No. no. Why not? Who is going to restart the shipping? Uh, the shipping is going to receive to receive. receive. Okay, who listen up? Who is going to receive the shipping? The question is correct, but listen up. You need the person at the beginning. Ever is ah okay. Ever is going to receive receive. receive. The shipping. Yeah. Yes, man. Yes. Like that. Así sería la respuesta. Okay. Okay. Very good. Very good. All right. Receive. Receive. Yes. Okay. The third one is is when is going when is going to work the new our, matter. The new material. Uh -huh. ¿Cuándo va a llegar el nuevo material? The material. Arrive. Is going to. Arrive. Arrive. Monday. Monday. Mm -hmm. Morning, morning, or oh, Monday morning. Monday, no, Monday morning. On Monday morning. On Monday morning. Yes. Okay. On Monday morning. Okay, people, listen up. If we haven't finished, I think we're going to finish this part like for tomorrow because I, like, you know, like it's basically 10 04 and I want, I don't want to keep you like you hear more from, from the, you know, like the time that you were supposed to spend. Okay, we're going to stop in here. We're going to do this as part of a homework, and tomorrow we will check this, okay? Let's okay, see. teacher. Thank okay. you. All right, let's go back to the main section. See you there. And everybody's getting the energy to finish the class, right? And that's why you finish the exercises. I mean, the question, the answers, everything, right? Everything, completely everything. Who finished? Which group finished? Que grupo terminó? Vanessa, Vanessa was like, ah, uh ah, -huh, it's class. <laughs> All the groups, teacher. Everybody, everybody finish? <laughs> Todos terminaron? Yes. Yes. <laughs> e -es ese yes me sonó así como que yes, 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 yes no, but no. No, 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 no. Yes. Yes, yes. A, a complete yes? No. Yes. Ah, okay, cool. cool. Terminamos la clase. Nice. El café lo hace todo, por eso Perfect. decimos. Perfect. Bien, entonces, si terminaron, me van a enviar una, una, una captura al grupo, like right now. <laughs> ah, verdad, ahí todo, digo que no. Ok, no, <laughs> no problem. This moment. Sí, yes. la Ahorita la enviamos. Yes, man, sí o no, yes. sí o no, teacher. Eso, eso. Hey, teacher, yes o no. No, se lo van a enviar ah. a ustedes si no terminaron. Listen up, no, listen. Ok. Listen. For tomorrow, 
Because of the time, porque no los quiero tener, o sea, ya sé que ya muchos estamos cansados, entonces sí necesitamos ya, like, go to sleep, you know. Entonces, vamos a, vamos a detenernos hasta acá, ok. Y mañana, <risa> al principio de la clase, vamos a, ok, a, a, a terminar esta, esta parte, ok. So, tomorrow is just going to be feedback. Entonces, mañana lo vamos a terminar, ok. And today we're going to stay in here. Nos vamos a quedar hasta acá, entonces... Eh, con respecto a ello y mañana lo vamos a retomar, ¿ok? Because tomorrow is just going to be practice from the main topics that we have been discussing. Así que permítanme, voy a pasar asistencia en las finish the class with this, ¿ok? Ok, good night. Ok. <laughs> no. Oh, come on, man. <laughs> Vas Ana... a sufrir, ¿eh? No me... <laughs> yeah. Ana Claribel. Present. Ah, ok, good. Ana María. Present. Ok, good. Carlos Ademir. Present. All right, Carlos, yesterday was your 10 minutes feedback. But since you didn't show up yesterday to the class, you're going to do it today. So I want you to stay for 10 more minutes right after the class, ok? Just as feedback. Ok. Good, thank you. Okay. Thank you. Uh, Eric Guillermo. Present teacher. Ok, good. Ever de Jesús. Present teacher. Nice. Fátima Alejandra. <coughs> Present teacher. Excellent. Gilmar Cruz. Present. Good. Jonathan Alexander. Present. Good. Jorge Elvir. Present. Nice. Carla Benacer. Present teacher. Ok. Margot eh, didn't show up today. Maritza Alcira. Present teacher. Ah, ok, good. Natalie Vanessa. She didn't show up. Romeo Alexis. Present. Good. Rosa del Carmen. Present. Ok, very good. Ruth Joana. I mean, Ruth is the one that's the left one. Right? Uh, Sara Carolina didn't show up today. Uh, Stefan Elisset. Present. Okay, nice. Vanessa Odette. Present. Okay, very good. William Alberto. Is it William here? All right. I think he left because he was working. Okay, uh, Roxana Yesenia. Present, teacher. Okay, nice. Nubia Zulema. Present. Okay, good. Jennifer Noemi. Present. Okay, nice. And let's see the last one. Diana Gabriela, who didn't finish today. Okay, cool people. So we're gonna stop in here. Let's finish those things like as a homework and tomorrow we will come back and check everything in here, okay, tomorrow. So let's see you tomorrow at eight o'clock, right? So tomorrow, listen, antes de que nos vayamos, recuerden, para mañana, básicamente terminamos la semana 1. Para mañana, a más tardar después de clase, estaría completada la semana 1 de las tareas en la plataforma. Ok, así que si sí, no hemos hecho las tareas, para mañana tienen durante el día para a poderlas hacer y a quedarnos con la tarea número 5 para después de clase. ¿Por qué? Porque antes de medianoche tengo que enviar esas notas you know, al INSAFOR. Así que espero de su colaboración, people. Ahora sí. Ajá. Eh, de casualidad podría publicar, bueno, o decir una hora qué día me toca el feedback. ¿El feedback? Ah, pues sí, porque así informo y llego hasta las 5 de la mañana. Come on, man. Nah, just give me a second. Ok, así rapidito. Le toca... Gilmar, uh, uh, el viernes 24. Viernes 24, no. Yes. Yeah, man. Yeah, toca viernes. Más que viernes. Mm. Good, man, I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, people, yes. so do the homework. Okay, do the, like, like the homework in the discussion section. Let's back out of the discussion section. Okay, I'm going to be checking that. And let's see you tomorrow. Bye-bye, people. Okay, so Carlos, Carlos, stay with me. Bye-bye, see you bye. tomorrow.
Tengo, pre tengo presión en este momento. <risa> así, veo, así veo. Ya estaba pidiendo salir. <risa> Yeah, I mean, that's pretty cool. Hmm. Okay. So I'm going to stay with you, Carlos, for about 10 minutes. Uh, just give me a second. Okay, cool. So this 10 minutes, remember, is just as feedback from uh, like the main topics that we have been discussing. So if you have like doubts or questions related to the topic from today or the previous topic, just let me know and we can clarify those doubts. So do you have any questions related uh, to the topic? No, no question. Is those that have Everything a structure? No. Todo está, está claro yes. con respecto a esta estructura? Yes, yes. Si la estructura está bien definida, no, no cuesta mucho redactar las, las oraciones o preguntas. Yeah, in that case, you're right, right? Yeah, in that case, if, if the structure is clear, so you can easily mm -hmm. understand, right? Okay, how about yes. with the platform, Carlos? Have you been working in there with the platform? No, uh, the, platform, the platform is, is, is clear, is, Ya llevamos varias, varios módulos haciéndolo, entonces. Okay. Está cool. bastante claro. Okay, perfect. And uh, have you been doing the homework in there? Yes. Nah, okay, Ojo. very good. Huh? Eh, entendí que si estaba en casa o, o qué, qué. No, no, no. ¿Cómo? Si ha estado no. haciendo las tareas en la plataforma. Ah, no. Eh, <ríe> y, y, tonight. Ah, ok. Eh, ok. Eh, Ajá. Ya, yeah, porque en ese caso lo mencionaba porque como mañana ya es miércoles, entonces mañana eh, estaríamos finalizando semana uno. Entonces mañana uh -huh. después de clase o más tarde a la medianoche yo tengo que enviar eh, notas. Entonces al Insaport. Entonces sí, para mañana eh, tendríamos que tener desde la tarea uno hasta las cinco. Ok. okay. No problem. Sí, five. escuché la indicación que, que dio y sí estaba. Sí, lo, <laughs> okay. que, lo que me acaba de decir. No, ah, no okay. hay problema, yo las completo. Ah, ok, completo perfect. So, mm -hmm. so that's, that is for tomorrow then, ok? That's, that's pretty cool then. So, eh, so we are clear with that thing, right? Y también queda una parte en la sección de discusión, ok? En esa sección de discusión de la plataforma, Carlos, vamos a estar subiendo, digamos, como apartados de, la, de, de cada uno de los temas que vayamos viendo, ¿ok? Con la finalidad de que podamos practicar eh, de una manera adicional. Entonces, esto nos lo okay. ha pedido el Instafor que podamos, que podamos trabajarlo. Y es esto, mire, solo se lo voy a mostrar de una manera breve. Vaya, esta es la parte del curso, ¿ok? Acá es donde se hacen las, las tareas. Usted ya sabe esta parte. Entonces okay. acá solo uh -huh. vamos a entrar en la sección de discusión. Que va a ser como parte de una tarea adicional. Ok. Acá okay. generalmente no le va a aparecer nada. Me hace con. Me hace con. This is module 3. And I had to go out with module 4. This one is, is yours. Ok, estamos acá, entonces vamos a la parte de discussion. Entonces acá, inicialmente así le va a aparecer en blanco. Acá simplemente le damos en todos los temas y acá okay. le va a aparecer ok, eh, la indicación para lo que vamos a hacer. ¿Qué vamos a hacer acá? Mira, algunos ya, ya la mayoría de sus compañeros han estado, particip bueno, han estado okay. participando. ¿Qué vamos a hacer acá? Vamos a usar Ken. Como, como pregunta, acá tengo las respuestas, usted me va a formular preguntas utilizando la estructura del can, right? Entonces, para, para ahora voy a dejar lo del el be going to, lo que estuvimos practicando, ¿ok? A modo de tarea en esta misma sección. Entonces, acá las va a poder encontrar en esta sección, en este apartado acá. Entonces, acá puede irse igual por los, las, las respuestas o las preguntas que han estado compartiendo sus compañeras, ¿ok? okay. 
Good. Entonces, esto sí. sería como una información adicional. Ok. De... Sí, eso no conocí. Trabajo en la, en la plataforma. Sí, estará, está justo a la par, en la sección de discusión. Ok. okay. From, from the platform, en la plataforma en este caso. Y esa es evaluada también, ¿no? Yes, sí, es part. Entonces, sí, porque okay. Insafor prácticamente nos ha dicho que esa es como una información adicional, práctica adicional, mm -hmm. aparte de las tareas. Okay. ok. And we got to participate. Entonces, tenemos que participar ahí, ok, por lo menos con un par de, de comentarios. Ok, Carlos. De eh, acuerdo, Carlos. Está bien. Perfecto, ajá. Eh, ¿Alguna pregunta adicional, Carlos? No lo escucho. Ah, ¿Alguna pregunta adicional? Mm, no. Eh, solamente está, está pendiente, las, está pendiente de las tareas y la parte de la discusión. Ah, ok. Ingresaré ahí. Eh. Va, perfecto, Pero Carlos. Sí, me... Entonces se lo agradecería mucho, ¿ok? Thank you, Carlos. O entonces. Gracias. Nos vemos mañana, Carlos, ¿ok? En the last video conference from the week, ¿ok? Bye bye. Good night. Ok, good night. Ok, bye bye. bye. So I just like, like, like giving an end to this type of uh, structure that we were practicing today. We just got, remember, be going to as the structure. And we got positive and negative statements using this structure. Okay, remember that in positive statements, we got, I am going to give you the information. What it means, this is like, like giving the meaning of a positive statement, okay? Like about something that is going to happen in the future, okay? Like in Spanish will be like, daré, okay, la información. So, It is something that is going to happen in the future. The second example, the airline is going to transport the shipping. So that is something that is going to happen in the future too, okay? So in question, it's like, where is the package going to arrive? Like, okay, donde llegará el paquete? So that is a question in the future, remember. In negative statements, we got it like, I'm not going to receive, or oh, I'm not going to give you the information. ¿Cuál es la diferencia? Simplemente colocamos not entre la forma del verbo to be y el going to. Y ahí tenemos una oración en negativo. Bien, esta fue parte de lo que estuvimos practicando en clase. Okay. So tomorrow we will finish uh, week number one.